Hi everyone, my name is Jack. I'm from Ireland. My job in First Leap is I'm the academic trainer. That means I work with all international teachers when they come into First Leap. So I'm here today to talk about the onboarding process, what you're going to expect from when you first get off the plane until you go into your centre and start teaching your first class. When you first arrive into China and you're in the airport, you get off the plane, Career China is actually going to pick you up at the airport. I'm Keanu Javert, all the way from Johannesburg, South Africa. One of our workers at First Lead Pizza, he took good care of us from the airport to the hotel, so everything went smoothly. The hotel's already been paid for for the week of um, training. The people that you'll be training with will also be staying in the hotel with you as well, so that means it's a good opportunity to meet some friends and get to know some people even before your training starts. Hi, I'm Kylie. I'm 24 years old. I'm so excited to go meet all my coworkers. I've already been talking with them on WeChat. Your first day of training will be in HQ, which is actually the building I'm in right now. You'll do your first day orientation in here. You'll also be doing some kind of team activities um, so everyone gets to know each other. When you first come in the doors here and you're sitting down in this room, you'll be given a pack, but you'll also get a couple of handbooks. We have a First Leap guide, which kind of gives you all the information about First Leap, things about China, such as subway cards, bank cards, phone, these things, necessary things you need when you're setting up your life in a new country. Your initial phase one training is a week long and the orientation starts it here on day one and it will be usually a Friday. On Saturday you'll go to a first sleep centre and you'll be there with a designated trainer who will help you and what you'll do is have a schedule where you can look at other actual experienced teachers teach first sleep classes. Spend the whole day um, watching some classes and getting to know how a first sleep centre wo uh, works. Regardless if you have a previous experience or not, it doesn't matter. Firstly, we'll teach you how to teach a first aid curriculum. After the week's training, you'll be fully prepared to go in and teach a class. The training itself has a lot of content in it, but it isn't too high to high intensity. It's quite fun, it's quite interactive. We don't have you sitting there, we have you actually giving things a go, having a practice, teaching things. I think training has been really helpful. I feel way more prepared for teaching because I've never taught before. My training's been good. I've enjoyed it. I've met lovely new people and uh, I've definitely learned a lot. We get to do one-on-one. -on -one. They make sure we know the material before we go on to the next slide. They also make sure that we work together as a team. The food is great, the culture is great, my new friends are great, and my school is great. Is it a spider? No! Now after you finish training, if you're staying in Beijing, you'll find your designated center here, and you'll be going straight to that. If you're going outside of Beijing, you'll be issued a train ticket which is already paid for. Regardless of where you go to in China to teach, um, you'll always have support. Be it um, your centre director, your academic director, every centre has one. This means that you'll never be by yourself, there'll always be someone to contact. When you're living in China, one thing you won't be able to live without is versus called WeChat, which is basically the WhatsApp or the messenger of China, so make sure you download that. So don't be afraid to ask Career China or First Leap, and um, there's always here someone to answer questions. So ask away. Okay guys, well I really hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was enlightening and maybe give you some kind of information about what training is like when you first come to China or first leap. I hope to see you here in this training room in the future. Uh, my name is Jack. Thank you very much for watching.